can you separate silica from a granite sample? So silica is sand, majorly composition of sand. We all know silica, this is silica. So if you have a granite sample, how would you separate silica from granite sample? Okay, this question is actually based on volatilization. So it is a volatilization technique that is going to be employed because from literature, we know in practical also that silica um, tetrafluoride is a volatile compound is a volatile compound so all we have to do is the sample of granite granite sample the granite sample containing silica is treated with hydrogen fluoride why hydrogen fluoride because silica can actually react with fluorine to give you silica tetrafluoride so that's just the concept there so we can able to when we get this compound formed then we hit it then it volatilizes so when the granite sample is reacted with hydrofluoric acid you will have this product silica tetrafluoride plus water as you can see, we've derived silica, produced silica tetrafluoride. So on evaporation, on evaporation, silica tetrafluoride volatilizes. So in that way, you've separated silica from granite samples. Oh, 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 oh,